Yo guys, in this GTA Online video, I will be showing you some of the best money methods after the most recent event week. As always, if you guys go on to enjoy this video or find it useful, make sure to leave a like and also consider subscribing. And without any further ado guys, let's jump straight into this video. The first money method that we have is the special vehicle races. After the most recent event week in GTA Online, these special vehicle races will be paying out double money and RP. And if you guys do earn GTA Plus, you will be able to get an additional four times money and RP. Obviously, I do not recommend you buy GTA Plus. To start up this special vehicle work you need to be in a GTA online session, press the pause button, go over to the online tab, select jobs, play jobs and then Rockstar Created. In this Rockstar Created tab if we go down to the stunt races you will see most of these special vehicle races here. Obviously I earn GTA Plus so I have this 4 times money and RP boost. For most of these special vehicle races you will be able to have up to 16 players. The best possible way to make money from these special vehicle races is to play these with a full lobby. However, if you guys do this completely solo, to maximize the amount of money you get, you will need to wait 15 minutes before completing the race. This is something that I would not recommend that you guys do. However, if you guys are relatively new players to GTA Online, this would probably be a good idea. You will see in the gameplay that I waited these 15 minutes and completed the race, and I got $50,000 for doing this. I obviously have GTA Plus, so this was four times the amount I would usually get. So with this standard double money, you will probably get roughly $25,000. But to summarize, the special vehicle races they are very fun to do my personal favorite race was the rocket voltic races the next money method in this video that we have is the first dose missions the first dose missions have had some sort of bonus for the last two or three weeks this time around after the recent event week they are paying out double money and rp if you guys have not done these first dose missions yet definitely try them out you'll also be able to set the difficulty to hard which will get you guys a little bit more bonus money and rp for me personally i have already played these first those missions and repeated them about three to four times at this point i am just really bored of these and i know a lot of other gta online players will be as well but either way for the double money and rp on the first those missions this can still get you guys some very good money i also believe like the special vehicle races if you wait 15 minutes before completing the missions you will achieve the maximum payout but now guys moving over to arguably the best money method for this week we have special cargo cell missions finally guys we do have a very good method to make money and the special cargo cell missions will be paying out 1.5 times money and rp there is multiple different ways that you guys can fill up your crate warehouses you guys really have the choice to use the terabyte or even just use the office just be very careful using the staff members inside of your crate warehouses apparently there is some sort of silent raid that can happen sometimes and the majority of your crate stock will go at the time of recording this video this has never happened to me in gta online but this is definitely something that can happen if if you guys are worried of this happening to you, I would recommend after each crate source mission that you disband from your CEO, just like we do with all of the MC businesses. But to talk more on the fastest way to actually source crates for your warehouses, the first method is to park the terabyte in between two of your warehouses and then begin sourcing free crates at a time from your terabyte. And the second method to sourcing crates super fast would be to set your spawn location to your office. Source some crates from your office and after sourcing these crates, buy the new invite only session and you will spawn inside of the office again. The second method really depends on your console. If you guys are playing on the next gen versions of GTA Online with the next gen consoles, the loading times between these sessions will be a lot faster. We can see in this crate warehouse I only have 3 crates, however this will sell for a massive $54,000. And after selling these 3 crates we obviously get this $54,000 and we get a massive amount of RP. I will definitely have a a very good RP method on the crates and a more in-depth breakdown of how you guys can source crates the fastest way possible. But now guys for the final money method in this video we do obviously have the time trials. Like always in these money methods the time trials are a great way to make some quick money. The HSW time trial is located in the textile city and the default time trial is located at the Vinewood Bowl. Altogether for completing both of these time trials you will be rewarded with $350,000 and this will roughly take five minutes to complete but yeah guys that will be all of the money methods for this week by far the best money method will be the special cargo if you guys fill one large crate warehouse you will be able to make some insane money but yeah guys let me know in the comments down below what your favorite money method from this week is and if you guys went on to enjoy this video or found it useful make sure to leave a like and if you guys are new to the channel and like what you see make sure to subscribe and turn on post notifications to never miss a video finally guys stay safe and thanks for watching